are there with all the voices that you do, are there voices that you hear and you think, how the hell did I do that? Like, I, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I can get that again. Are there any that challenge you like that? Um, no, well, I'm trying to think. There are some, there are a lot that I can't remember what I did, but when I hear it, it comes back. You can do you it. You know, yeah, because it's, it's rare that I'm doing something that's so strange mm -hmm. that, you know, I can't get back there. Or if it's something that's that strange, I pretty much remember it. We'd remember it because it would know? be that yeah. difficult to do. That exactly. makes sense. Okay, that's cool. Um, now you mentioned Vamp. Yes. Um, now they're going to be doing a movie, a live action movie, correct? Wasn't that announced on the 25th, oh, I think? Yeah, so okay. you that's news to you? That is news to me. Okay. So I was going to um, ask you what you thought about that. And Ground Zero is the, is the new game. Okay. Um, and then they're doing the live action thing. That, I'm very interested in seeing that because Metal Gear is so cinematic. Um, I would be fascinated to see how someone tries to translate it um, into live action. I mean, the toughest thing would be, you know, the games were six, seven hours. How do you get that into a two-hour movie? <laughs> yeah. So, we'll see. Was that something, now do you, are you staying away more from acting and you would just want to do the voice or you'd be interested in that? Yeah, no, I mean, I, uh, it was a movie I was in, uh, Real Steel, uh, came out uh, last year. And, uh, you know, I have a web series called Inside the Legend. You know, I'm, I'm constantly moving back and forth between voiceover and on camera and between stage and recorded stuff. There, to me, there's there's no boundaries. There's no lines between them. Good, good. Now, that seems to be the theme, and I think that everyone should remember that if they're looking to get into voice acting or acting, is that every single person that I've spoken with, everybody, is you don't just do one thing. You don't just act. It's acting. You do voice acting, as versatile as you can possibly be, and do everything you love, and then that reflects in your work. Right. And you keep getting more work. No, it's, it's important to have a toolbox. You might become really well known for your hammering, but you can't start out, you can't walk into town with, all I've got is a hammer. Let me build something, because nobody's gonna hire you to just do one thing. Yeah. Until you become known for doing one thing. Exactly. And, and then you gotta, it's like, you know what, but I really wanna use my screwdriver, guys. Come on, <laughs> like, let's find something for my screwdriver. And that sounded weird. Did that sound weird? <laughs> now now it saying. sounds a little now it's, weird, but. I wasn't asking you okay. to, about the screwdriver. I'm the hammer guy. You're the hammer girl. No, because I would have hammer to time. Out, yes. For dance. You're older than you uh, than you look. If you get that reference. Yes. She is. She is. <laughs> she is eternal. She is an elemental. She is the air elemental. I lay out in the sun every day. <laughs> Don't use anything on my face. And I eat really bad. That's right. Lots of red meat. Keeps me looking very young. And very and young. the flesh of babies. Oh, that's a secret. Seriously. Oh, cut that. Can you cut that? Cut that out. Cut that part out. Your web series? Let's end on that. What, what are uh, you doing with the web series? Oh, it's a new comedy web series starring myself and a woman named Vanessa Ragland. It's uh, just the two of us. Uh, we play the hosts of an interview show called mm -hmm. Inside the Legend, and we interview characters from fiction, history, mythology, anywhere. But they're not how you remember them. For instance, uh, a couple of weeks ago, we aired an episode where I played Beowulf, the hero of legend. But he was closer to Randy Macho Man Savage <laughs> than he was to an ancient uh, hero. Um, and last week, uh, well, two weeks ago, she was Jill from Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill. But it was a, she was a very film was that noir. The noir. Yes. <laughs> I, you, I watched. Yeah, I did. I subscribed to the channel. Oh, cool. you know. It's it's silly. It's fun, and we get to play a lot of funny characters. Great. So, yeah. so it's wonderful. So in between all the work, you still get to, even though you're working, you right. still get to go, you work on different characters and do your... You, that's do that's your the thing. You have to keep doing it. And hopefully people will pay you to do it, but even when they don't, you have to keep creating your own. Yeah. yeah. Great. Okay. Well, thank you thank so you much people. for speaking with me and for being here at the 2012 Sabaton Con. Do you think you'll be back next year? I hope so. Okay, great. Well, so. we'll see you next year. All right. Thank you, Victoria. And as soon as the camera goes off, I'm going to pull off your wig. <laughs>